Hey guys, it is Sandra here, and yes, I'm in the bathroom. I am finishing getting ready to go to the gym, and I figured now would be a good time while I'm thinking about it to do a quick um, weight loss, fitness, health update, how things are going, um, yeah, that kind of stuff before I get all sweaty and gross. But um, anyway, so things are going okay. I did have a little uh, moment because I took my weight the other day and I realized I had actually put on a couple pounds or a few pounds and I wasn't happy about it, but um, I know I'm doing everything I'm supposed to. I'm eating really, really, really good. I am working out really, really hard uh, every day. I take at most one rest day a week and uh, I just need to focus on my results and not so much the number on the scale and that's a really hard thing to do, especially when you see the number go the opposite way of what you want it to be going. So, um, yeah, so that's kind of as far as the weight goes. I am seeing muscle growth. I'm doing pretty intense um, weight training. At least for me, it's intense because it's still new-ish to me. And our trainer had us start on this program. So it's a six-week program. It goes in two-week intervals. So we finished the two first two the, the first two weeks, and um, it was difficult. And then we went to the second two weeks. And when we started those, I was like, oh. So I'm dreading having to go to the third set of two weeks because it just changes each time. So I don't know, that could be part of my um, weight gain. Um, AF is coming, so that could definitely be part of my weight gain, who knows. So I'm trying to just, I'm not even weighing myself at the moment. I'm just putting that out of my mind because what good is it gonna do me, you know, because I'm still doing what I'm supposed to be doing. So, um, as far as his program, I started doing something on my own, on the side, on the days off where I'm not doing his routine, um, the, the trainer's routine. So I'm really, really doing cardio on those days. Like I will do my elliptical and then I'll run a mile or two and then um, biking for at least a mile and then the stair stepper for at least a mile. So I get in about four to five miles worth of some sort of cardio in there, and then I'm doing core stuff on that day. So I'm really trying to work my abs and also my back on those days as well because uh, they could use some help too. I am getting muscle in my arms. I don't know if you can even see it, and in my shoulders. Um, like they're starting to get some, but I'm still having, you know, the underarm stuff, but that is slowly going away. Uh, my thighs and my calves are where I'm seeing the biggest difference. Um, the fat on my legs is going away. It's really just I, like trying to pinch it, it's hard to grab. So I'm definitely very muscular in my legs now and I'm almost getting to the point where I'm like, mm, I don't really want my, my thighs to get any more muscular. I'm kind of content with where they're at. My butt is getting bigger <laughs> a little bit and lifted, which is good because um, I, our family, the whole family, my whole mom's side of the family, and even my dad's side of the family were built like a board, like there was nothing to us. So I could use a little extra back there. <laughs> um, other than that, I'm still feeling really good. Oh, I don't know if I told you, but in the past I was having problems with getting sick. Every time I worked out, I would throw up or feel nauseous or feel like I could throw up. And then I kind of felt like I had morning sickness all day long, all the time, and it just really didn't go away and I didn't know what was going on. So I started taking out my um, fish oil and I quit taking fish oil and that's what it was. So apparently there's a really small amount of people that get sick from fish oil and I am one of those which is kind of a bummer. So I'm not sure what to do about that because I really would like to take fish oil. And I was still having a little bit of queasy problems and I stopped taking my multi multivitamin and I don't get sick at all anymore. So um, as far as like vitamins, I think I need to find some sort of extended release, something or other that isn't as harsh on my stomach. Apparently I have a really weak stomach and it's very sensitive to these things. So I just need to be mindful of that. And yeah, um, I think that's about it. And I will probably update you guys in a while again. I think I'm at the last time I weighed on the scale was 1 
89. So I'm out of the 190s, which is good, but I had gone down into the 180s and then kind of came back up to 189, which is kind of when I was like, really? But so for now, I am at 189 and yeah, I'll see you probably in a few weeks for another update. Bye guys.